Mike Tomlin told players during a team meeting Tuesday that he plans to be the Pittsburgh Steelers head coach next season and that he didn't answer a question about this future following the team's 31-17 loss to the Buffalo Bills in the AFC wildcard round because doing so would have lent credibility to something the coach felt was unfounded speculation, multiple players who were in the meeting said to The Athletic. The question about Tomlin's future in Pittsburgh came near the end of his post-game news conference. Tomlin did not answer and instead, walked away from the podium. This, coupled with the early playoff exit, several media reports questioning his future and that Tomlin is about to enter the final year of his contract, helped heighten public speculation about Tomlin's time in Pittsburgh. Earlier on Tuesday, Steelers defensive lineman Cam Hayward defended Tomlin during a passionate speech to reporters. Hayward questioned the disrespect Tomlin's been shown in terms of his job. Why would he answer a question like that? Hayward said about Tomlin's job status. He was worried about trying to win a playoff game, and then last night, we just lost a big playoff game. Why does he have to address that then? Tomlin has been the Steelers coach for 17 seasons, making him the longest tenured coach in the NFL with Bill Belichick's departure from the Patriots. He has a 173-102 record in Pittsburgh and led the Steelers to a Super Bowl win in 2009. The team has never posted a losing record under Tomlin, but hasn't won a playoff game since 2017. If Tomlin wants to return in 2024, it's hard to imagine the Steelers going in another direction. This is an organization that doesn't like to pay people not to work. Pittsburgh was reluctant to move on from failed offensive coordinator Matt Canada a year ago at this time, in part, because he had one year remaining on his deal, a decision that ultimately came back to bite it. If Tomlin wants to return to the Steelers, the next question is this. Will he simply ride out the final year of his deal, or will he get a contract extension this offseason? The coach is scheduled to talk with the media during his regularly scheduled end-of-season news conference later this week. Hayward said before Tomlin's remarks to the team that he thought Tomlin was going to be the coach here. He praised Tomlin for being locked in from the very get-go, and asked why there's concern over a coach who is under contract for one more year. Mike T wants to be a Pittsburgh Steeler, Hayward said is a Pittsburgh Steeler. Why would anybody ask for anything else? For Hayward, Tomlin's been his only head coach in the NFL. The Steelers drafted Hayward number 31 in the 2011 NFL draft and the six-time pro bowler has played 13 seasons in Pittsburgh. It wasn't just Hayward who supported Tomlin after the Steelers' exit. Pro Bowl linebacker T. J. Watt said Tuesday he wants to play for Mike T. It was huge in my contract talks, Watt said. I don't want to play for anyone other than Mike T., offensive tackle Broderick Jones said. He's never had a coach, like Tomlin, 
praising his coaching style and the collaborative conversations. For eight-time pro bowler Patrick Peterson, there's no doubt in his mind that Tomlin is the right coach. I know I love it here, and I love Coach T and everything he's done to motivate this team and put us in positions to be successful, Peterson said post-game Monday.